extra, extra morning magic because I'm staying at a Walt Disney World Resort. Wait, extra what? I'm so excited. I'm staying on property. And I've read all about it, this, uh, this early morning magic. This is such a great benefit for resort guests. Wrong. Wait, I thought I get extra magic hours in the park. Yes, extra magic hours. That's what I said. No, you said early morning magic. That is the same thing. Is there a difference? Yes, that is a special ticket event you pay, well, extra for. Huh. Then we'll head over to Disney After Hours. That's going to cost you two. Wait a second. Okay, okay. Well, at least we get that moonlight magic thing. Oh, cool. You're a DVC member? A DVC what? Disney Vacation Club. Club. It's like Disney's timeshare. Oh, no, we aren't. That's a DVC exclusive event, unless you buy into the timeshare. Oh. All magic comes with a price, dearie. I'm starting to see that. But no worries. This fall, guests staying at a select, select Walt Disney World Resort get extra, extra magic hours. And how much is that going to cost me? No, that's not the way that works. That's not the way any of this works. Then how does it work? Stay right there in your seat. So, this year at Walt Disney World, everybody is really, really, really excited about the opening of Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. Galaxy's Edge! Yeah, yeah, yeah! yeah, yeah. <laughs> and to accommodate the anticipated crowds, Disney has now added extra, extra magic hours. Extra, extra magic hours! <laughs> Thank you, animal. Um, the question, the question is, what are extra, extra magic hours? They're just question. earlier extra magic hours. Not to be confused with all the other things that have hours and magic and events in it. I can't tell you how much confusion I see in online discussions <laughs> about the difference between extra magic hours and people I honestly being confused that they think, are you okay? Yes. <laughs> Honestly, being confused, Sorry. that's okay, about what benefits they're actually entitled to for staying on Disney World property. So we wanted to kind of run through them really quickly. Make it more clear. Make it a little more clear. So extra magic hours and now extra, extra magic hours, which are just extra magic hours that start earlier in the morning, um, like are the benefit mm -hmm. that resort guests staying on Walt Disney World property will get this summer, 2019. Yes, dear. Um, I have a question. What's your question? What time does Extra Extra Magic Hours start? Well, extra, that's a good question, Molly. Extra Extra Magic Hours are in select parks on select dates, um, and you're going to have to reference the Walt Disney World calendar with park hours when you're planning. For Hollywood Studios, extra, extra magic hours are going to start at 6 a.m. So they're not, they don't all start at the same time? They don't all start at the same time. So you're going to have to check the schedule. But at Hollywood Studios, it's going to be 6 a.m. And that, some of them aren't the same day? And some of them aren't the same day. So they're going to have also extra, extra magic hours at other parks, I guess, to accommodate for guests who don't want to go to Galaxy's Edge, who are kind of avoiding Hollywood Studios. That's a good idea. I think that's good a great... Good job, Disney World. <laughs> it's a good idea. However, it's 6 a.m., which means that you're going to have to leave your hotel, give yourself an hour. You always give yourself an hour when you're traveling anywhere. Or hour and a half. At 5 a.m. Or hour and a half. And because we're talking about Galaxy's Edge here, maybe two hours in advance, which means that we're going to have people lining up Outside of the theme park at 3 a.m. We, <laughs> <Sorry. suggest, laughs> we suggest if you want to make it to Galaxy's Edge before there are a lot of people there, 
Bring your breakfast to go. Yeah, that's right. Don't, don't, no stopping in the food court. I mean, that, that actually brings up another great question. Where are these people eating? Because none of the food courts are open that early. A lot of restaurants aren't going to be open that early. So we're going to have cranky people waiting in line to get into Galaxy's Edge who haven't eaten anything. So that's something that we always make sure we do. We always order food to get sent to our hotel, mm -hmm. and if we can't do that, we get it sent to, like, the main, we get, if we can't get sent to our hotel room, we get sent to the main lobby, then we, then somebody brings it from the cart, and then they drop it off at our hotel room That's for right. us. So, extra, extra magic hours are this summer's extra magic hours at Walt Disney World, starting at Disney Hollywood Studios at 6 a.m. for on-property guests. Now, that's Six a benefit. Six, zero, zero. Six. <laughs> With the little dotty things in the so, middle. I mean, but why didn't they just, like, leave, maybe leave the park open late at night? Like, I almost feel like having, like, a midnight to 2 a.m. Yeah, extra magic like, hours it would, be really cool. would make people, more sense. People will be walking around with lightsabers and people won't be cranky. Yeah, so this is going to be interesting. Now, I don't know what kind of crazy people would get in line to get in the park this early. I mean, definitely, I'm going. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get her out of bed. Definitely not us. <laughs> well, definitely Quote, me. unquote. Yeah, not us. We're not that crazy. Quote, unquote. So this is, this is right now currently Disney's plan for um, dealing with crowds, and to, uh, to give a benefit to resort guests at Walt Disney World. There's no way they can do what they, they're so doing in Disneyland question. where they have the reservation system. Yes. So their plan could change? I'm, plans can always change. Everything is subject to change. I would like to see a virtual line like they've now put in place in Disneyland, which I think would make it much smoother. Um, I just think that there's go there's one or two things are going to happen here. Either we're going to have no crowds because people are going to be scared away, which there's some of that seems to be happening in Disneyland. How come? Or it's going to be pandemonium because people are afraid about the crowds and people who aren't interested in Star Wars per se. There are people out there who don't care about Star Wars. <gasps> I, know, I can't it's trust shocking. them. It's shocking, but it's like if they don't like chocolate. If you don't like Star Wars, you can't trust. That's right. Don't trust people who don't like Star Wars. Or Disney in general. Or Disney in general. If they don't like Disney. This is the most random video we've ever made. It's eight minutes of babbling at this point. Um, so let's let's, let's get back on task here. We're so, sorry for wasting your time. <laughs> we'll get back on topic. These are not the YouTube videos you're looking for. <laughs> okay, I'm going to pause this for a second. <laughs> Get okay, we're back. We've composed ourselves. So. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not. Maybe not. So, extra, extra magic hours are starting at 6 a.m. at Disney Hollywood Studios. 6 a.m.? And, um. No, it's not the same. There's no, at, at this point, there's no indication that Disney is going to be using a reservation. Disney World is going to be using a reservation system the way Dis Disneyland like Disneyland did. Disneyland is. But I think that's what they're going to be doing for the annual pass holders now because now they've said platinum and I think plat only platinum pass holders are going to have an opportunity for limited oh, slots yeah. for advanced, uh, advanced previews for platinum? Galaxy's Edge. Yes, we are with <gasps> platinum. But that doesn't mean, I mean, I keep checking my email to see if uh, I got an email I don't have. I was checking my phone to see if I got an email from Disney Destination saying, hey, here's your opportunity to sign up and this is the dates. We don't even know when those are going to be yet. Um, so I think or when they're, they're going to be released. When they're going to be released. So, But we don't know what the dates are. So this is Disney's plan right now. Their current plan, the only established, known, fully available to the public plan for it's dealing with Galaxy Edge, Edge crowds is extra, extra magic hours. It just sounds magical. That extra magic at hours. 6 a.m. Yeah, so that's what you get this summer for being a Walt Disney World resort guest. There's so many hotels at Disney World they couldn't, they can't do the reservation system they were doing at Disneyland. I just let's think it would try be to impossible. name a few. No, we don't need to name the Disney. I want. To we don't need to break. I want. It. Like what? Pop Century. Okay. Yachting Beach Club. Mm -hmm. Get the pencils too. Hope name with me. 
No. Yes. No. Yes. Okay. So moving on. Art of animation. Art of animation. Okay. Stop. So <laughs> moving there's, on. But there's definitely more than. Other ton of hotels on Walt Disney World to property. Count. Too many for us to count right now. Um, so then that goes on to well, what are these other things? Because I see people getting confused. So. Um, early morning magic happens at some theme parks where you can buy, it's a special ticket event. It's a separate payment. I don't remember how much they are offhand. They're close to $100 where you can buy early access to a certain part of the theme park in the morning. They also have a similar thing at night where you can buy a special ticket event, um, for Disney after hours. They're also doing a Disney villains thing right now. Those are not included with your stay at a Walt Disney World resort. Those cost money, money, money. <laughs> it costs money. That's going to cost money, you. Money, money. All magic comes with a price, dearie. I think I do better. If you know where that's from, let us know in the comments. She does do it better. All um, magic comes with a price, dearie. <laughs> let us know in the comments if you know what that's from. Um, so, and then there's the uh, Moonlight Magic, which is a DVC exclusive event. Where you can also meet... Um, characters that you can't usually meet right. at on a regular basis. In a right, but you have to be a DVC member, and then there are even rules within the DVC system about whether your DVC membership allows you access to those events. So when you're planning your Walt Disney World vacation, the only thing that you get for staying on property, and it's a great benefit. I'm not saying the only thing, like, this isn't a big deal. It's a great benefit, but it's extra Extra magic hours and this year. And extra magic and hours. And extra magic hours. Um, not everything with the word extra or magical or magic in them, not every event that you it's hear free. is free or included with your stay or even available to you but as a Walt of, Disney World guest. Some of them are, but most of them aren't. So just keep so that in mind. Money, when, money, you, money. <laughs> when you're booking your vacation, Know that it's the extra magic hours and the extra, extra magic hours that are included. And not all those other things that you hear about. Those are going to be special access events or special ticket events. And they are going to cost you more money. Money, money, money. I hope that clears you up. And at the end of the day. We just have something to tell you really, really quick. Extra, extra magic hours. Are, read all about it. Read all about it. <laughs> extra, extra magic hours. Remember, are the benefit that you're going to get. So you can get in line at 3 o'clock in the morning with a bunch of people waiting with these who haven't had breakfast. Um, so you can get into Hollywood Studios at 6 o'clock in the morning. I have joined the dark side. So, who's ready for Galaxy's Edge? Me. See you there. See you there. If you like this video... Click on the like button, and if you haven't subscribed already, do that too. And hit the notification bell for future videos. And oh, by the way, we plan on going to Galaxy's Edge and seeing those crazy people waiting in line the first week at 6 o'clock in the morning. So, <laughs> well, hopefully we can bring footage of, we can't live stream now because YouTube changed the policy and we can't live stream because we don't have a thousand subscribers unless you want to help get us there. So hit that subscribe and button. And tell your friends. Tell your friends. And tell your friends to meet us at Galaxy Such. <laughs> this Bye. has gone completely off the rails. Bye-bye now. Bye. 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 Bye.